Time, come on, great friends, friends go, go to a very distant land. Jake the dog and Finn the human. Fun will never end. It's adventure time. It's almost ready, but it seems like it's missing something. <laughs> well, maybe we should go fishing. <laughs> maybe we should go find something. Do you want to go fishing? Sure, bro. I'll ask BMO to watch my everything burrito while we're gone going fishing. Hey, BMO, will you do that for me? Okay, thanks. Man, I hope we don't catch any Alosa Pudo Pudo Hargus. I've caught I've caught a lot of them last time I fished with Lady Rainicorn. She told me that eating them has been found to cause reproduction failure in salmon and trout species. What the stuff? What are Aloso Pudogar? Don't worry about me. And what's reproduction? Bro, I forgot you had pool brain. Don't worry about reproduction. We'll learn about that some other day, man. But Elosa Feudo Haringus is a scientific name for ale life, and it's a fish. That's kind of tops. That's pretty tops. I kind of want to learn more. Well, homie, homies hope homies. So let's get out of here. Okay. Oh, hey guys, what's up? I'm just finishing up on my formula on how Kyla is so cute. We need help learning about a certain fish so we can slay it or something. Only if it's evil. That's what righteous heroes do. <laughs> okay, guys, let's just put the science junk and get my book of Ooh out and we'll get started. So what's the species you want to learn about? Owl life. Its scientific name is Alorsus to Inhardingus. Whoa, well, that's a mouthful. Let's see. Oh, right here. In the uh, Animalia Kingdom, in the Cordata Phylum. It's, it's small, usually less than 30 centimeters long and 400 milligrams in weight. See, here's a picture. Alewife was first detected in Lake Ontario in 1873. The species was native to Lake Ontario and then spread through the Great Lakes. Want to know about the life cycle? Yeah, boy! <laughs> this stuff is mad mathematical. I hope my everything burrito is okay. Good. Well, adult alewives enter rivers from early May to June and swim upstream into lakes and ponds to spawn. They reproduce sexually. Each female, female produces 60,000 to 100,000 eggs, which are about 1.3 millimeters in diameter, hatch in about three to six days. The new alewives then migrate to sea from mid-July through early November. Alewives are carnivores, carnivores and eat mostly fish, eggs, aquatic crustaceans, and zooplankton. 
Their presence in the Great Lakes has caused less native fish species because of competition. Sometimes it can cause dysfunction in reproduction when eaten by salmon. These are factors of their parasitism. Live fish can clog industrial pipelines and sometimes die in large numbers, resulting in lots of dead fish on beaches. Icky. It has many predators, like the lake trout, bigmouth bass, salmon, walleye, and more. Since alewives feed mainly on plankton and bottom-dwelling crustaceans, they are particularly good at accumulating toxins in their fatty tissues. It's best not to eat too many of the fish predators of alewives. Alewives have other uses, including pet food, lobster and snow crab bait, and processing into fish meal and fish oil. Alewives are not usually fished in the Great Lakes since they are small and too bony to eat. There's adaptation. Their adaptation is in that during cold winters, freshwater populations of alewives are prone to massive die-offs from the temperature. Well, Finn, you really don't need to say anything, slay anything. To help you, you can tell others to follow these rules. First of all, you need to learn to correctly identify the alewives and other invasive species. If fishing with bait you collect yourself, consider using bait fish from the water where you are fishing. Dispose of unused bait in the trash rather than in the water. Never transfer fish from one body of water to another. Always drain water from your boat, lie well, and bilge before leaving the access area. Thanks, Princess. We'll be heading home now. I'm so hungry and I miss my everything burrito. Yeah, thanks, TB. Hey, Bimo, we're back. Thanks for watching my burrito, Bimo. You can take five. Aw, smell chow, dude. We forgot to get something for your everything burrito. No, man. Because you know what time it is, bro? Adventure time! <laughs> Undertaker, yeah. Look, see, I said, okay. Okay, put. Oh, I can go? Yeah. <laughs> what the stuff? What's a low stuff to do? Our hunter? <laughs> and what's the production? <laughs> Olivia! <laughs> what the hell? I'm so sorry! I was squatting. I was squatting and I was laughing and I couldn't you, help it. You? It's okay, it's okay. We can start where I farted. No, we're starting. Adventure time!